When searching a database, it's important to know the difference between subject versus full record searching because it can really affect the results that you get. And we're going to illustrate this concept using the Academic Search Complete Database. The first thing I would suggest you do is go to the Advanced Search. That way you can see all the options are available to you and especially you can see what defaults are being applied to the search that you do. You always want to make a deliberate choice based on your understanding of how the search works rather than just type in anything and hit enter. Now let's say that you're going to do uh, some kind of search about world view. And you go ahead and take the default option, which is a full record search. We're going to see how much we get when we do that. We found 3,587 articles doing a full record search. And if we take a look at some of the results, let's see how rel relevant they are. Um, we've got something here on a um, religious worldview, um, 20th century China, we got political worldviews, history worldviews. Um, this really illustrates what a full record search does for you. You get a lot of results. We got over 3,000 things, but they vary in how relevant they are. Full record search is anywhere in the description of, a, of the article for your key term. It could be in the title. It could be in the abstract. And just because an article uses your key term somewhere doesn't mean it's really totally about that idea. To tighten up the relevancy a little bit, let's see what happens when we do subject. We're going to look for worldview only as the subject of, of the articles. We should get less results, and we did, as opposed to 3,000 things. When we look for subject, we just got 232 results. Now let's check the relevancy and see what we're getting. Um, can cultural worldviews influence network composition? That could be relevant. Um, here's something on whoops. Here's something on co-creating my worldview. That sounds pretty good. It sounds like what I want to know. That's what subject searching can do for you. When you search by subject, you get less results but they tend to be a little bit more relevant. That means it weeds out a lot of the junk for you so you don't spend your time looking at things that don't match what you're really looking for. You can use that function of subject and full record searching to your advantage. The basic idea is that you want to search full records to get the most hits. If you end up getting too much, then switch over to subject to focus your results instead. So if you're in a database and you notice that what you're really doing is a full record search and you're getting too much and they're not relevant to what you want to know, go ahead and switch over to subject and see if that tightens up the relevancy for you. Conversely, if you type something in as a subject and you don't get anything, or get very little, then it's time to open it up again, switch back over to the full record search and bring in more articles. By playing around with the subject versus full record search, you can really influence the results and influence the relevancy of what you find.